like Teddy Gray on stuff. Wooshy gives a proper reaction. And now for something completely different. My gang back again. G Devith, we made it, featuring DJ Soda, who I've never heard of. If anybody can give me any information on DJ Soda, I'd be uh, very, very thankful for that. But without further ado, we have more from G Devith. Everything that he's brought this year and recently, to be fair, has been fire. So I'm hoping that he can uh, he can deliver this time. Let's go. Subtitles too. The Hurricane. Uh, hmm. Did that did that just say that Soda is from Yeah. Artist Soda from Korea. Huh. Okay. I haven't heard of uh of, of Cambodians linking up with Koreans before. Is this the first time that this has happened? Let me know in the comments. Made it. This is the boy Ellen. Dip way to the moon. I'm sure he said that in a track before. I'm sure he said that in a track before. But I like the fact that, like, because Dipway doesn't usually do uh, English lyrics, so this is nice. Uh, you want to know me you can only know me if you're socrates like you'd have to be you'd have to be somebody very deep in order to understand me this is why i hope that g david watches reactions just to see if like if anybody has got close to to sussing him out do you know what i mean like to, to finding out who and what he is Okay, <clears throat> just rhyme million with opinion. <clears throat> I don't think I've heard those two things rhymed before. See what I mean? When they use the English language, they do something different with it. God damn. This is like, this is a good feature for, for G Devith as well, because it's somebody relatively unknown, but they're fitting the, the scope of this beat perfectly. Let's go, Soda. Yeah, yeah. Hey, G -David, we made it. Shout out to 
Ew, the base. <laughs> nice. And the producer, Ditway. <clears throat> I was going to say this is like a perfect G Devit beat, you know? That sort of like low rumbling bass. Perfect. And for the stuff that he's been doing recently, it's it's definitely on brand. Everything that he's been coming out with recently has been more more hard hitting rap, you know? It started to sound a lot more like trap rap, sort of rage music. He started to go in, in, in that direction. I don't know if it's because he prefers that music now or he started listening to some artists that make that music or he's performed it live and he's seen the effect that it has. I don't know what the case is, but whatever it is, I'm glad that he's making music like this, you know? This, along with the last few that he's made, it's, it, it, they've, they've all been hard. Can't fault him. And I know, you know, most of you guys have seen the G Devith and Wandar met. I think it was at somebody's wedding. Um, they crossed paths and it didn't look great. It didn't look like there's going to be any reconciliation anytime soon. It looked quite tense, you know. Um, but hopefully, we see something from G Devith and Wandar, you know. <clears throat> That's the only thing that I'm really waiting on like progression wise from both G Devit and Vandar, I'm waiting for them to reconcile, you know, and then both come together to, to lift the next generation of, of stars. Do you know what I mean? It doesn't make sense that there's, there's almost like there's two different camps. Doesn't make sense. It makes sense if they're trying to go down the sort of Americanized route, like Tupac versus Biggie, G Devit versus Vandar. <clears throat> it makes sense for that, but I don't think we I don't think we get the best music out of artists when that's the case. I feel like when when they're working in tandem, that's when we get the best music, when there's collaboration, when there's respect, when there's features, you know. That's what I want to see. Hopefully we see it this year, if not the year after. I'll keep praying on it. You guys do the same. Without further ado, it's been your boy Deuces.